hello student welcome to my channel learn more maths i am varak kumar today we are going to learn uh, problem number 3 exercise 6.2 student so what he has given just uh, see here uh, find the respective terms for the following a piece so he has given first one a1 is equal to 2 a3 equal to 26 find a2 so student he has given a1 and a3 is asking to find us a2 so see student how can we find very easy student uh, we can solve very easily so see student um, a1 is equal to 2 it has given a1 itself is known as a so a is equal to 2 so and a3 is equal to 26 it has given student uh, a3 is equal to 26 so how can we write a3 a3 can be written as uh, a plus 2d is equal to 26 student so a3 can be written as a plus 2d we have a is equal to 2 just substitute here a is equal to 2 we can get d value so i am substituting a is equal to 2 so 2 plus 2d is equal to 26 take 2 to the right side from this we can get 2d is equal to 26 minus 2 which is 24 therefore d is equal to 24 divided by 2 d is equal to 12 student so we have a and d value we can find any term not only a2 is asking to find as a2 so a2 is equal to a plus d a2 is equal to what student a plus d we have a is equal to 2 plus d is equal to 12 2 plus 12 is 14 so this is a2 student very easy so next one more bit student uh, second bit in the third problem he has given a2 is equal to 13 a4 is equal to 3 find a1 and a3 he has given a2 and a4 he is asking to find as a1 and a3 so see student how can we find uh, so just a2 is equal to 13 he has given a2 is equal to 13 so how can we write a2 student a plus d is equal to 13 a plus d is equal to 13 a plus d is equal to 13 so i am writing a is equal to or let it is equation number 1 student so what he has given next a4 is equal to 3 has given so how can we write a4 student a plus 3d so a plus 3d is equal to 3 so let it is equation number 2 so i am subtract subtracting equation 1 from equation 2 so subtracting equation 1 from equation 2 so subtracting student uh, subtracting equation 1 from 2 equation 1 from 2 what is equation 2 a plus 3d is equal to 3 so what is equation 1 a plus d is equal to 13 a plus d is equal to 13 so it becomes negative negative and negative these two gets cancelled 3d minus d is 2d is equal to 3 minus 13 is minus 10 student therefore d is equal to minus 10 divided by 2 that is minus 5 so d is equal to minus 5 so just we have to substitute d is equal to minus 5 in equation 1 we can get a value so i am substituting d equal to minus 5 in equation 1 so substituting d equal to minus 5 in equation 1 substituting d is equal to minus 5 in equation 1 so what is equation 1 should a plus d is equal to 13 so a plus d is equal to 13 so i have to write uh, minus 5 is equal to 13 just we have substituted d equal to minus 5 here so a is equal to 13 minus 5 becomes plus 5 so 13 plus 5 is 18 so a is equal to 18 student we have a and d value we can find a1 and a3 so a1 is equal to a only so that is 18 student is asking to find as a3 a3 is equal to a plus 2d so just is asking to find as a1 a1 itself a only that is 18 student a3 is equal to a plus 2d have to substitute a and d values so we have a is equal to 18 plus 2 into d is equal to minus 5 i am writing minus 5 so 18 2 into minus 5 is minus 10 18 minus 10 is 8 
देर फोर वी हैव ये वन इज इक्वल टू एटीन एंड ये थ्री इज इक्वल टू एट सो जस्ट इज आस्किंग टू फाइंड एस दीज टू टर्म्स सो दीज टू आर द Uh, two bits in the third problem, student. First bit, second bit. There are five bits in the third problem. Next, we have to solve three more bits, student. Student, this is the third bit in the third problem. So, y one is equal to five, y four is equal to nine and half. Find y two and y three. So, he has given y one and y four. He is asking to find us y two and y three, student. Ah, uh, how can we solve? See, student, very easy. So y1 is equal to 5. Y1 itself y only that is a 5. So next y4 is equal to 9 and half. He has given student. It is mixed fraction. Convert into improper. Two nines are 18 plus 1. 19 divided by 2. So but y4 how can we write student? Y plus 3d is equal to 19 by 2. Y4 can be written as y plus 3d. We have y is equal to 5. Just we have to substitute here 5 plus 3d is equal to 19 divided by 2. So 3d is equal to take 5 to the right side 19 divided by 2 minus 5. So by finding LCM we can get 19 minus 10 divided by 2 that is 9 by 2. So 3d is equal to 9 by 2 student here we can cancel 3 ones and 3 threes directly. So we have d is equal to 3 by 2. So d is equal to 3 by 2. So just he is asking to find us a2 and a3 student. a2 is equal to a plus d. How can we write a2? a2 can be written as a plus d. We have a is equal to 5 and d is equal to 3 by 2. Just we have to substitute here 3 by 2. So find LCM 2 5s are 10 plus 3 divided by 2 that is 13 by 2 student 10 plus 3 is 13 by 2 this is a2 and also we have to find a3 also a3 how can we write a plus 2d so a3 can be written as a plus 2d we have a value a is equal to 5 just substituting a equal to 5 2 into d is equal to 3 by 2 so substitute here d equal to 3 by 2 2 2 gets cancelled student 5 plus 3 is 8 so a3 is equal to 8 so therefore he is asking to find us a2 a2 value how much student a2 is equal to 13 divided by 2 and a3 how much student a3 is equal to 8 so just he is asking to find us a2 and a3 student this is the third bit in the third problem next we have to solve fourth and fifth bit so next this is the fourth bit in the third problem student what he has given just to see here a1 is equal to minus 4 a6 equal to 6 find a2 a3 a4 and a5 so see student again how can we solve solution first he has given a1 is equal to 4 so a1 itself is known as a student a is equal to minus 4 and also he has given a6 equal to 6 a6 equal to 6 student so how can we write a6 a plus 5d is equal to 6 a6 can be written as a plus 5d so we have a value that is minus 4 just i am substituting here minus 4 plus 5d is equal to 6 take minus 4 to the right side it becomes 5d is equal to 6 plus 4 that is 10 so take d is equal 5 to the right side d is equal to 10 by 5 5 ones and 5 twos so d is equal to 2 student so now we have a and d values we can find every term student is asking to find as first a2 so a2 is equal to how can we write a2 student a2 can be written as a plus d so here a is minus 4 plus d value is 2 minus 4 plus 2 is minus 2 so next a3 a3 is equal to we can write a2 plus d student so a3 can be written as a plus 2d or a2 plus d so a2 we have minus 2 plus d is 2 student minus 2 plus 2 is equal to 0 and is asking to find as a4 so a4 is equal to a3 plus d student so a3 is 0 plus d is equal to 2 0 plus 2 is equal to 2 and also is asking to find as a5 so student a5 can be written as a4 plus d a4 plus d so we have a4 is equal to 2 in the same way d is also equal to 2 2 plus 2 is equal to 4 
सो देर फोर वी हैव ए टू इज ईक्वल टू ए टू इज ईक्वल टू माइनस टू एंड ए थ्री इज ईक्वल टू जीरो सो ए फोर इज ईक्वल टू ए फोर इज ईक्वल टू टू एंड ए फाइव इज ईक्वल टू फोर सो जस्ट इज आस्किंग टू फाइंड एज ए टू ए थ्री ए फोर ए फाइव स्टूडेंट दीज आर द वैल्यूज ऑफ ए टू ए थ्री ए फोर एंड ए फाइव सो दिस इज द फोर्थ बिट इन द थर्ड प्रॉब्लम स्टूडेंट नेक्स्ट वी हैव टू सॉल्व फिफ्थ बिट सो स्टूडेंट दिस इज द फिफ्थ बिट इन द थर्ड प्रॉब्लम सो ए टू इज इक्वल टू थर्टी एट ए सिक्स इक्वल टू माइनस ट्वेंटी टू फाइंड ए वन ए थ्री ए फोर ए फाइव सो ई हेज गिवेन दीज टू स्टूडेंट इज आस्किंग टू फाइंड एज ए वन ए थ्री ए फोर ए फाइव सो ए टू इज इक्वल टू थर्टी एट ई हेज गिवेन स्टूडेंट सो हाउ कैन वी रेट ए टू कैन बी रिटन एज ए प्लस डी इज इक्वल टू थर्टी एट सो लेट इट इज इक्वेशन नंबर वन एंड ऑल्सो ई हेज गिवेन ए सिक्स इक्वल टू सो ए सिक्स इक्वल टू माइनस ट्वेंटी टू हेज गिवेन स्टूडेंट ए सिक्स कैन बी रिटन एज ए प्लस फाइव डी इज इक्वल टू माइनस ट्वेंटी टू लेट इट इज इक्वेशन नंबर टू सो नाउ फ्रॉम दीज टू इक्वेशन वी हैव टू सॉल्व ए एंड डी वैल्यूज टू फाइंड ए वन ए थ्री ए फोर एंड ए फाइव सो सी स्टूडेंट जस्ट आई हैव वी हैव टू सब्सट्रैक्ट इक्वेशन वन फ्रॉम इक्वेशन टू सब्सट्रैक्टिंग इक्वेशन वन फ्रॉम इक्वेशन टू स्टूडेंट सो सब्सट्रैक्टिंग equation 1 from equation 2 so what we get what is equation 2 student a plus 5d is equal to minus 22 what is equation 1 a plus d is equal to 38 student so it becomes minus minus and minus plus a minus a gets cancelled 4d minus sorry 5d minus d is 4d student Minus twenty two minus thirty eight it becomes minus sixty. So four d is equal to minus sixty student. Take four to the right side. D is equal to minus sixty divided by four. Four ones and four fifteens are sixty. So d is equal to minus fifteen. So student now we have d is equal to minus fifteen. Just we have to substitute equation one. D equal to minus fifteen in equation one. So from equation one. From equation one, what is equation one, student? A plus d equal to thirty-eight. So a plus d equal to thirty-eight. So substituting d equal to minus fifteen, student. So take minus fifteen to the right side. We get a is equal to thirty-eight plus fifteen, which is equal to fifty-three. So student, now we have a and d values. We can find any term. So he is asking to find us first. A one is equal to a one is equal to a itself. Which is equal to 53 student. So he is asking to find as a3. A3 is equal to what student? A2 plus d. So a2 plus d. So we have a2 student. A2 equal to 38 plus d is equal to how much? Minus 15. So 38 minus 15 it becomes uh, so how much student? 23. So 38 minus 15 is 23. So next he is asking to find as a4. A4 is equal to A3 plus D student. So A3 we have 23 plus D is equal to minus 15. So 23 minus 15, which is 8. So 23 minus 15 is 8. Next A5 is equal to A4 plus D. So student, we can write A4 plus D or A plus 4D. If we don't know A4, we can use A plus 4D. But we have A4, we have to use it. So a4 is 8 plus d is equal to minus 15. So it is 8 minus 15. Student, we can get minus 7. So therefore we have a1 is equal to. So a1 is equal to how much student? 53. So next a3 is equal to how much? A3 is equal to 23. So next a4 is equal to how much? A4 is equal to 8. And a five is equal to minus seven. So this he is asking to find student a one, a three, a four, and a five. These are the values of a one, a three, a four, and a five. So this is the fifth bit in third problem, student. Uh, so there are totally five bits in the third problem. Third problem completed, student. Uh, so next uh, we have to learn fourth problem, student. If you are watching first time my video, subscribe to my channel, learn more maths by Varukma, student. I am doing videos in both the media, a uh, Telugu medium and English medium. <laughs>